Hey there folks, in this video we're gonna take a look at a very nice number theory problem in which we wanna prove that this number is divisible by 1,897. But before I start with the solution, consider subscribing and ring the bell to not miss my latest videos. So first of all, let's say that this is A. So basically we wanna prove that 1897 divides A. In order to do that, let's start with the fact that A equals 2903 to the nth power minus 803 to the nth power minus the quantity 464 to the nth power minus 261 to the nth power. Now we all know that x minus y divides x to the n minus y to the n. Therefore, I can use this property here and say that 2903 minus 803 divides 2903 to the nth power minus 803 to the nth power. Now notice that this is just 2100, and we know that 7 divides 2100. Therefore, if I put these two together, I can say that 7 divides 2903 to the nth power minus 803 to the nth power. Now let's go ahead and do the same thing with these two terms. So we can say that 464 minus 261 divides 464 to the nth power minus 261 to the nth power. And the left hand side is 203. And again, 7 divides 203. And since 203 divides our number, we can put these two together and say that 7 divides 464 to the nth power minus 261 to the nth power. So we prove that this part is divisible by 7 as well as this part, so we can say that A is divisible by 7. So we can write that A equals 7 times some integer like B. Now let's go ahead and rearrange the terms in A and say that A equals 2903 to the nth power minus 464 to the nth power minus the quantity 803 to the nth power minus 261 to the nth power. Next, let's go ahead and use the property with these two terms and these two terms. So we can say that 2903 minus 464 divides 2903 to the nth power minus 464 to the nth power. So the left hand side is 2439. And if you factor this, we can say that 271 divides 2439. So again, if you put these two together, we can say that 271 divides 2903 to the nth power minus 464 to the nth power. And next, let's go ahead and deal with these two terms. So we can write that 803 minus 261 divides 803 to the nth power minus 261 to the nth power. And the left hand side is 542, which is two times 271. Therefore, I can say that 271 divides 542. And again, if we put these two together, we can say that 271 divides 803 to the nth power minus 261 to the nth power. So we proved that this and this are divisible by 271. Therefore, I can say that A is divisible by 271, which means that 271 divides A. Now, we already know that A is equal to 7 times B. So we can go ahead and say that 271 divides 7 times B. And it is obvious that 271 does not divide 7. Therefore, I can say that 271 must divide B. And that means that there has to be a C, an integer like C, where B equals 271 times C. So we have this equation. And we have this one. So let's put these two together to see what we can get from it. So A equals 7 times B, and B equals 
271 times C. So we can replace B with 271 times C and say that A equals 7 times 271 times C, which equals 1,897 times C. So A is a multiple of 1,897, so that means that 1897 divides A, and if you look back, we can see that this is exactly what we wanted to prove. Great, so this is it. Thank you for watching this video, and if you find this video helpful, smash the like button and click subscribe. Hopefully I will see you later.